Hi, Ryan Sweeney here again. I uh, just want to talk about who I am as a servant leader and as a trainer. Um, you know, when I was in Afghanistan and I was a, a battle captain or, or an operations manager fighting the, the current fight, uh, I had to train and develop uh, the, the the people within that within my shift. Uh, so in order to do that, um, you know, the example went uh, when I was 30 days or right at the first turn of, of me being in like the seat to manage the daily operations. Uh, I, I, we had a we had a fallen aircraft, an aircraft that had crashed in the mountains of Afghanistan. And when I did, uh, when that happened, my my radio operator uh, just dropped the radio and like disappeared into the back corner. So I was there trying to talk on the talk on the radio, manage the phone calls, uh, manage the chat windows, and, and I just realized this this wasn't you know standard. This was an operating procedure, and this we couldn't fight the fight effectively if we did that. So. Uh, you know, I took the, them under my wing and started to train them. I had to train them on basic uh, communication procedures, how to talk, how to be concise on the radio. Uh, then I had to drop, uh, once they got more fluent and comfortable in that, uh, I actually sat them up in my seat. I managed the radio and I let them just manage the phone calls, something simple, uh, you know, and then if they could answer the question, they would answer the question. If not, they would hand the phone over to me. Then they monitored the chat windows. And after that, I empowered them to do look for specific things within those chat windows. Um, so they were in charge of, of notifying the aircraft of, of Roz's or restricted flight areas. So, um, and, and by the end of it, uh, they were managing multiple methods of communication uh, at the same time and allowed me to kind of plan not only the daily operations a little bit more, but also plan future operations and, and you know, really uh, empower them uh, as a servant leader to go ahead and execute the mission. And uh, we, we became a well-oiled machine after that.